Hello everyone, uh, I just wanted to show off my new custom saber I made from various plumbing parts and things you can get from the custom saber shop. Uh, you can see it's modeled after Luke's Return of the Jedi saber and Anakin's Graflex hilt. Uh, I'm going to take a second to show you what everything is. This is an elite shower cap that you can get at Lowe's for about $15. Uh, this used to work the valve. But uh, now it's my D-ring clip. My choke is a copper reducer. You can also get it Lowe's for about $3. I cut it a little bit shorter. And it's attached to the sink tube with some mighty putty. My grips here are rubber gaskets and O-rings that I glued together. And I drilled a hole here for my button, which is a momentary switch I got from Radio Shack. And I'm using a, a push nut as my switch basil you can see it's got this chrome lip here that covers up the uh, rough edges on my hole then here's a one and a half inch sink tube that I dremeled out the cowl shape into or the shroud and on the back there's an oblong hole for added detail and you can see these are the classic uh, windshield wiper grips from the custom saber shop they're about three inches long and on the end here is the uh, screw on piece that came with the one and a quarter inch sink tube and an end cap you can get from the specialty drawers at Lowe's and I drilled a small sound hole in here and now I'm going to power you on, add on and show you what it looks like this sounds pretty quiet but that's alright I got the chip out of an Anakin Clone Wars lightsaber and I replaced the blue LEDs which are pretty dim with uh, white ones you still can't see it in uh, in a fully lidded room but uh, I do have ultra bright amber LEDs coming in so that'll fix that up. You can see it uh, strobes a little bit when it clashes, it's kinda cool. I didn't have room to put in the whoosh sensor but that's alright, I'll figure that out later. And uh, there you go.